time to. Um, meditation was something that I got into by um, actually running into it online. And I was just really desperate. It was in a bad situation. I was really, you know, feeling down in life, uh, feeling in lack, and kind of was just tired of feeling sick and tired of uh, myself in life. And uh, like I've talked about before, um, eight years ago, I was uh, diagnosed with severe depression disorder, um, post-traumatic stress disorder, and um, obsessive compulsive disorder. Um, and anxiety disorder. I don't suffer from these anymore because I meditate. Um, meditation is so easy. You can just take like even like, you know, just five or 10, 15 minutes out of your day. Um, it works very well. Um, I can't tell you how uh, great it really, great enough, good enough things about it. Uh, I give it an A plus rating. Um, so many people are starting to apply meditation and practice and mindfulness and mind awareness into their lives and their lives are starting to become a lot more uh, fulfilled and people are getting happier all over the place from using meditation and practice and mindfulness um it's very powerful um, it works very well um especially if you have a hard time getting out of your head like i used to i used to have a very hard time i still do but i use the the um, i use meditation to bring myself back down to earth and to slow my brain down and um, just to recenter myself. And it, it's really powerful, it works very well. Um, you know, um, it's, it's, you know, a lot more people are doing it now. Um, I put some really good ones up on my YouTube channel. Um, yeah. And it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's just, you wanna get in a quiet place. Um, you know, you can listen to music in your car or if you're at your house and you have alone time away from the kids or your loved ones or whatever. Um, you get free YouTube uh, meditation videos uh, that you can uh, listen to and watch. I like vis I like watching from home. Uh, I'll put it on YouTube on the TV or if I'm in my car, I'll listen to meditation music. It's very soothing and it helps recenter your mind and it helps take you out of your head. I know there's a lot of people out there suffering from depression, like I, like like myself. Um, I used to suffer from major depression disorder, like I said, post traumatic stress disorder, and uh, obsessive compulsive disorder, and uh, I think there's a few others too. Um, I never thought I was going to get past being depressed. A big part of it too is learning to. It comes to a mind awareness and learning to get out of our own heads and learning to get um, train ourselves to get out of. Uh, thinking in the past. Our past experiences and emotions follow us until we become more mind aware about it, a mind, mind awareness. And when you start f thinking about stuff in the, in, in the past that makes you, makes you sad or makes you feel in lack, um, this is where this meditation and mindfulness, manifesting mindfulness really comes in handy. Um, because you're able to refocus your brain uh, to and to calm your brain down, your racing mind. I used My mind used to race really crazy. Um, now I'm able to bring myself back down to earth and you can too. It's very, very simple. Um, these meditation exercises, nothing to be ashamed about meditating. It's something to be proud about. Um, it's, it's the best medicine you can get. Uh, you ask me, it's better than any antidepressant out there, anything. Um, you can create anything you want with, with, uh, I mean, uh, it's a, it's unlimited when you're able, when you start meditating. Um, it's a, um, it's so powerful, especially to have it free at your, you know, at our fingertips to be able to use meditation in our lives is very powerful. Um, I'm one of the last people out there that a lot of people know would have expect, expected to get into meditation and stuff, but I've experienced a lot of loss in my life and, uh, you know, um, not, you know, and a lot of sadness and depression. And, uh, you know, I was diagnosed when I was you know, a kid with depression and, um, I wanted to overcome it and I wanted to find success in life and uh, some happiness, right? And uh, that's done wonders for my life. I'm able to now get out of my head and I'm able to react differently to people and, and places and things. And you'll see that getting into meditation um, and the man manifest in mindfulness is very powerful and it will, um, it will stop your uh, uh, racing minds and it will, uh, if you just, you just Listen to the music and listen to the guide on the music. Like I said, I put them on my website and they're on my Facebook page. Um, 
It's so powerful to be able to do it. If anybody needs any uh, assistance getting into it, I'd be more than glad to help you. Um, this stuff is awesome. This stuff will change your uh, life. Uh, meditation will change your life. Practice and mindfulness will change your life. If you want to be happy, if you're, if you're tired of being depressed and sad, angry, lonely, um, or, and you're tired of having a racing mind, um, practice and mindfulness, meditation is the key, is it. It's it. It's awesome. You can't get any better than that. No drug beats it. Um, you, it feels so powerful. It's the it's a, it's a, it's most powerful natural high you can get. Okay? It's recentering ourselves, slowing down our brain waves, our pat, and, and our thinking. Okay. And another thing, too, is really important. Like I said, I've said uh, in, the, in the past, um, trying to stay out of our heads and trying to stay out of angry and negative situations and negative people is huge. Okay. Walk the other way when it comes to confrontation. It's not worth it. Um, it brings you down and it makes us depressed. Um, we, uh, you know, we're a complicated species, and we need to start. And we start when we start to learn to get out of our own heads. That's when creativity and abundance and love and life uh, happens. Um, we're all unique in our own way, and when we stop judging ourselves and judging others, that's when the real magic happens. All right, and that's when this meditation mindfulness comes into play. Um, is, well, I'm doing this because it's such a huge, 87% of the world being depressed is pretty bad. Um, and I want to bring more awareness to people that meditation is, uh, it's a cool, it's a new, uh, natural way of, uh, you know, uh, carrying our mental, uh, you know, aggressive thoughts. And it's, uh, it's a great way to get out of your own head and, um, and to get out of your depression and, um, you know, and keep your mind uh, at bay. Um, I r highly recommend it. Um, I can't tell you enough good words about how what meditation's done for my life, right? Um, it helps put things into perspective and it helps stop the race of minds because we tend to overanalyze everything, right? In life, we overanalyze stuff. And it's unnecessary. We don't need to do that. And we don't need to leave in our past emotions and past experiences following us our whole lives, keeping us down. Um, it feels great to let those go, right? It's a victory. Let that stuff go. And to let resentment go and to avoid drama. Drama is so bad for our minds. And especially if you're trying to create a new, uh, you know, better life for yourself, to be able to stay away from drama and negative people going to impact your life significantly and you're going to become a lot more happier of a person um like i said too try to put a smile on your face out when I'm around people and friends and even if you don't even if you're tired you don't feel like it, put a smile on your face like open the door for people uh, say hi to people and i'll start helping you come out of your depression too um human contact and conversation is very big it's very important uh especially for depression and anxiety and stuff when we go out of the realm when we do new things um, it really creates uh, uh, a natural high and, you know, and being at one with nature, getting outside and stuff. Um, if you're starting to feel, if you're feeling depressed in your, in, in your hell up in your house, go for a walk, get outside or just go sit outside and you'll start feeling a lot better um, because we, you know, need our vitamin D, even though it might not be sunny every day. Um, when we go for walks, uh, go for walks in the woods or whatever you want. You know, whatever type of, uh, we're, getting, we're staying active and trying to, to also not have the same routine every day is huge. And I'm going to tell you this other idea, this other, well, it's not an idea, it's, it's, it's a fact that works really good that I started doing a while ago. And it's, uh, um, what it is, is making sure that you take care of yourself. When you wake up, shower, uh, clean yourself up, uh, look good. When you feel good, when you feel when you know you look good and you're shaved or whatever you want to call it, uh, or your makeup is, um, or, you know, girls, the eyeliner, whatever you wear, um, you feel good, look good, you're going to feel better mentally inside, and it's going to show it on the outside to other people. And your vibrations are going to be really powerful, and happy vibrations, um, they bounce and people feel them. Um, and that's when we find real the real love in life, right? Is when we have positive vibrations because they kind of they react to other people's vibrations too, and this stuff is very crucial for mental illness, uh, for for dealing with depression and anxiety and feeling a lack and stuff. I mean, the biggest thing is we need to learn to get out of our own heads. 
own heads are holding us back in life. But with meditation and mindfulness, that is the cure. Um, please subscribe. Um, I know I haven't really pushed the subscriptions too hard, but I appreciate that. And um, this is Derek checking out. Hope everybody has a good day and this helps some people.